Hey guys, that's me, that's Sunny Suzuki. Um, today was a reaction on uh, Bob. I was a rep <clears throat> again, reaction on my ghost TV. So, by me, I react to another video, but yeah, today <laughs> because I have um, problem the reaction, no, not problem reactions uh, from the uh, you know, frozen, <laughs> frozen video sometimes. The frozen video, so I was a reaction on the video, was okay, replay again. Uh, oh my gosh, TV. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> keep watching this video. Okay, yes. Hey, right. shall we? Uh, so I guess I like them. My favorite, so I can wake up every morning myself. So, yeah. <laughs> so let, let's go to the reaction of the video, shall we? And just calm down, right? Calm down, right? So I uh, will not let us react to speak in the summary myself now. Um, well, let's get a look here, All right? I was on my mother's camera because I got myself very full of us for freaking things. Okay, sorry. <clears throat> I hope the fun of you started this year, man. <laughs> All right, let's go. There you go. Open up. There's nothing scarier than seeing something terrifying happen in your own home. What's even worse is when you get it on camera. Today I'm going to be showing you unexplainable paranormal videos from around the web. Some so scary, they have been banned in other countries. But before I show you anything, I'm going to need you to smash that like button. That way I can tell the ghosts in this video not to haunt your dreams forever. So this random dude is just walking down the hall and then out of nowhere he's just getting picked up and moved around i can't explain oh, this like i didn't this even is... see him get picked up before what the hell like look at this just gets picked up like you know he did somebody dirty like this is karma coming to pay him back i don't know what it is that's a poltergeist coming to pay him back so in this next clip there's this girl that is in her apartment and she has a TikTok. you can go see her TikTok video and see some of the comments always love going into the comments on some of these videos because they're quite amusing but she notices that there's a shadow from the other side of the window you could kind of see it i haven't played the clip yet but can you see this james has not seen this yet i have okay she sees this shadow on the other side of the window and she's already like you know hey is somebody messing with me like what's going on here so this is what happens she's like there's something there and i don't know what it is so she opens up the curtain and she's like, yo, what the hell? Ain't nothing there. Okay, it gets better. It gets better. You see the shadow right there, right? Yeah. Okay, look, there's nothing there's nothing there. And then it moves. <gasps> and then it moves. What the hell? And then it moves. Bro, what I thought that was like the box that was behind there or something. That That's what, what I thought. I thought at first glance maybe it was this bottle here that was just, you know, it's a shadow. It's not a big deal. But when it started moving, hmm, let's watch this again so you can see. Right, nothing there. Nothing there. Right, now, it's, that's the shadow from that box. I thought maybe the window's dirty from the other side. You know, it looks like this dark outline. But, uh, 
dirt wouldn't move that fast on the other side of the window. I mean, just look at it moving. I don't know. I cannot describe this. I have no explanation for it either. I can't. No. Now, I went to this girl's TikTok account, and she doesn't have paranormal videos. Like, this is just something that happened to happen to her, and she couldn't explain it. So this is her saying, I'm scared. I don't like, remember. what is that? This clip right here, I don't know what to think of it. It's like this little girl is laughing and she's behind this doll. This is a life, first of all, that life-size Barbie or whatever it is, like that's, no, I don't do that. That's like, right. I don't like haunted dolls either. But there's something behind it laughing. At first I thought maybe it's a kid playing hide and seek. No, look again. What the hell? And no, that's not the best part. So the guy's already freaked out because he's like, what the hell was that behind this life-size doll? And then he gets a little bit closer and the freaking eyes move, bro. The freaking eyes are moving. Like, what the hell is that? Talking about eyes moving, I found these other TikTokers that they don't do much paranormal either. And they decided to play a prank on their friend. And they had this creepy mask. James has not seen this. this is probably going to freak him out. Oh, boy. Here we go. So No sleep for me tonight. Here's these guys right here. And they're, they're showing this mask. And they're like, they're showing how the eyes don't move. And there's people in the comments. They must have made a video before. And they're saying in these comments, like, dude, the eyes moved on that thing. So watch this prank. So they're trying to wake up their friend. And like play a prank on them. Now look a little bit closer. Did you see that? Did you see the eyes moving? What the hell? The Wait, that's eyes, the same mask? That's the same mask. The same mask. And the eyes are moving. This dude is like, what the hell? So they didn't even see this as they were filming it. They seen this probably afterwards after they released the video. People were going crazy. They didn't see anything oh. about the eyes moving. They decided to play paper, rock, scissors to see who would sleep with this mask oh, at gosh. nighttime. <laughs> really? That's him. He's got to wear this mask to bed. It's almost as if, like, they're going to prank their friend and there's a spirit in there that's like, no, we're going to prank you. We're going to prank you. Wow. Now, these kind of clips are some of my favorite when people have nanny cams set up in their house. Not only are they my favorite, but they're the most terrifying, in my opinion, because when you have a camera rolling all the time in your house, the place where you call home, the place where you come to relax, your safe place, and you find something like this, it's, in my opinion, it's the, it's the scariest thing. Not only is there something moving in the background, but this happened to some people after they visited the Bell Witch Cave. Oh. It's like something was walking in their living room, walked behind the fan. I don't know if that's a baby crib, maybe it is, but it was walking by their baby. And this happened after they went to a haunted location. So, yeah. Something that followed them home. Look, it's showing like arrows. So it looks, it's almost like it got caught by the camera and it walked away. And it's kind of like translucent. There's like a little fan and then it just it like walks away and then goes uh, and disappears off into the kitchen. I mean, the scariest part of that is the fact that you have kids in the house or your kids may be next to that. I mean, I'd just be terrified to have my kids near that, wouldn't you? Yeah, absolutely. The only clip that I have ever seen that looked somewhat like this was when I was at the Crescent Hotel with Mackenzie and Kelsey and Tiffany and Cameron and somebody had showed me, somebody was recording and then this thing like darted out in front of the camera and it like they didn't see it at all. Mm. Like their human eye didn't see it, but when they look back at their video, they saw this. And this is the same scenario with this video. The person didn't see it and it looks like it, it could be like, I don't know. You let me know. Tell me what you think. There's this little girl playing. Her parents are shooting a video of her. And watch real close. Something. Did you see that? What? what that? Something just darts out in front of her. And it's unexplainable. Like if you play this clip real slow, you can't even make out what it is. At first glance to the normal eye, it just looks like it could be another person just running by but this was not human whatever this was truly unexplainable and it's even more unexplainable when you slow the clip down i mean it almost kind of looks like a bird but you know there's no bird in there right weird okay remember i said that nanny cams are terrifying check this next one out there's this baby rolling in its 
in its crib and there's like a face you see that face oh hell no bro like i uh -huh. wouldn't know what to do if i saw that on a camera like that is terrifying like what is that i would not have the baby sleep alone ever again after that. no oh my god and i mean it seems like this baby's restless like, that's the real know. life boogeyman bro they that's the real life boogeyman right there and that was in the oh. dark that was IR. So speaking of nanny cams, here's another one. So this mother and two daughters are on the bed. Her baby's on the bed just like playing. And obviously, I mean, you probably shouldn't have a baby that little on the bed anyways. But let's see what happens here because I cannot explain this. You see that? It's almost like she got like pulled. And it's like an invisible force. There's no way she just fell backwards. I got to see that again. So I'm going to slow it down. So look. She just gets pulled back, falls, like that just does not look normal. At first, maybe I thought perhaps the baby pushed herself back, but she's all the way forward. Looks like something yanked his head, her head back. It's like something yanked her back. This is one of those clips that I just cannot debunk because, first of all, I would not be playing with my kids like this for video views. And hopefully the injury wasn't serious. Mom picked her up and was just cuddling her truly terrifying so in this next clip right here i did a little bit of research and somebody was having a demonic entity in their house they reached out to a wizard to come and exercise this demon so they were doing an exorcism of the house i'm not sure if perhaps somebody was being demonically possessed as well i didn't get quite that far in my research but the house had an infestation of demons now first of all i'm looking down and they have a homemade ouija board looks like it's created in marker on the table bad idea bad idea so <laughs> you can see the wizards in the corner what is a wizard i've never heard of a wizard a wizard i mean i've a, heard of a wizard but it's a male heard... witch i think okay i thought you're supposed to like have priests come in to help with that i've never heard of using a wizard yeah i never heard of that either but maybe that's what these people wanted and maybe it was a bad idea because watch what happens okay <laughs> so they it seems like he's doing some sort of ritual chant and if you look behind the girl in the black right there if you look behind her the cabinets start opening up and you know the guy's like doing some sort of ritual he's talking to the demon or whatever and none of them noticed this it, this is in spanish it's written and it says you know no one had noticed that this cabinet was open in the back so it gets even better okay they're they're chilling for a couple minutes and then this happens all right wait for it Ooh! What? look at that so replay this so something comes flying across the table no and they all go running it was probably the planchet of the Ouija board, their homemade Ouija board that they did. That's why so, you don't play with Ouija boards. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where that clip came from. I don't know how old it is, but I know that it had something to do with a demonic presence that was in the house that they were exercising. Now this next clip, in my opinion, at first, I'm kind of just watching it and I'm like, whatever, it's a kid in a pool, right? No, it just looks like a normal day in the pool this kid's like looks like he's slipping out of the guy's hands maybe he was teaching him how to swim i don't know watch that clip again in slow motion okay and pay attention to the bottom okay look at this out of nowhere keep watching keep watching okay you're not gonna see oh here it goes look at that where did that hand come from what in did the you see world? that did you see that there was another hand that came up from the bottom look at that and then it disappears. That's the edge of the pool. Right. Wait, what did it come out of the edge of the pool? I don't know where it came from. It's almost like somebody was underneath pulling this kid down because it looked like the kid was kind of struggling in the pool and the dad was like, here, hang on. Maybe the kid didn't know how to swim. Obviously he needed a vest or some swimmies or think something. Think it was like trying to drown the kid? I think it was a ghostly hand trying to pull the kid down i don't know a, a demon more like it that's scary I mean, being a child feeling something like that and then I imagine telling your parents like they wouldn't even believe you well they have the video footage to look back at that's even more terrifying could you imagine having video footage of your worst nightmares oh my god would you ever take your kid back to that pool after that hell no no way <laughs> no. me neither okay in this next clip this lady pulls out her phone and she's like what the hell is this is it human is it an animal? You tell me. Looks like a dog. 
sea, Dios mío. Es una persona. No, no es una persona, no es una doblada. Bro, y que no te está la mamar, en chef. Y voy a hacerte todo ese tío, o sea, cuando think, the think. There's nothing anymore. That is human. Um, turn back at this. That supposed to back like this, then like this, and like, like that. So, so there was a hand like this. There's a hand on the left hand like this back. The legs say it's a normal, so normal legs up up there. You know, from the any body human. It is a head, so the like face, a yeah, head as one. Well. Of here this so like so like like this this for back like this so definitely bro uh, there was a human this this human is I, I think the woman was as a boy I think a lady this I think a lady yeah there was a single lady the yeah there was a lady yeah that's a human bro this human uh, exorcism defect that you know like a boy. No, she says it's. It looks like a human folded, like, like folded in half. I think that's what she said. She's literally crying out to God. Like, what is this? Yeah, like I don't know what that is. It if if it is a human, they're like doing one of those guys. Does it like move? backwards? It's moving a little bit. Like, look, look at his head moving side to side. Like, what in the world is that? That's terrifying. I don't know. Comment below. Do you think that's a dog? Do you think that's a person or something no. else? Because it looks like a big dog to me. No, it's... But maybe not. Because she would have known. Like, she, if it was a dog, she would have realized. I don't know. Maybe a, maybe a deer? I really don't know. Okay, this probably has to be one of the funniest. I mean, it's, it's not funny. It's funny, but it's scary, too. Girl's just walking down the hallway, and she looks into this door. And this is security camera footage. And she just gets yanked Whoa. into this room. Like, watch this again. Like, I just cannot explain what this is. I mean, women like their hair, okay? I, I don't see a woman just, like, playing around and, you know, hey, like, pull my hair. Okay? I mean, maybe Ow. some women like their hair pulled. I don't know. You know what I hate about that clip? Is it ends. It's like, why not film you going into the room like, ah, I don't know. That's it's one true. thing that I hated about that clip. We're back to the nanny cams. <laughs> Truly terrifying nanny cams. This little girl, she look, looks like she's doing her homework and camera's on her and watch what happens. Yep. She's like, I'm out of here. I don't want nothing to do with this. Keep watching, keep watching. It gets better. Nothing happens for a while. And then look at these papers just going crazy. What? Do you think that could... Look, keep watching. It's like there's stuff moving at the bottom. That gets... Oh, hell no. I thought that was the wind at first. That is not the... <gasps> no, no. What? I don't even know what that... Then the table starts moving. Look, what the hell? <laughs> no wonder she was out. Wow. Dude, she was out. <laughs> I'd be too. This mother was woken up in the middle of the night when her motion detector on her camera alerted her and she starts looking behind the crib and you can clearly see this like mist off to the left here then you could see something walking by terrifying okay here's another one now this was so popular that it made it to the news this baby was obviously sleeping and whatever it was that started walking around in the room woke it up this is truly unexplainable i don't know what it is but you can obviously see that it's not human it's too it's too misty or too clear to be human. I mean, not the scariest thing that I've ever seen, but it's it's scary because that's someone's baby. Right. You know what I mean? I have seen some situations like this where the babies wake up with scratches on them, sometimes bites. I don't know why there's certain energies out there that target babies 
it's oh. really sad now here's another one and i found this girl on tiktok and she was actually kind of desperate to reach somebody that knew about the spiritual world maybe a psychic maybe a priest somebody who could help her now she had been living in this house with her fiance they're both in the military it had been a couple of years and she'd always been feeling off here she would see things from the corner of her eye she just didn't feel right while she would sing to her daughter to go to sleep in the nursery she would catch her daughter kind of gazing up at the ceiling staring at something sometimes talking back at it and smiling yeah pretty terrifying and she got a little suspicious and put a camera in the nursery and this is what happened if you or someone you know is a medium please i would like your help the other morning I woke up and took out my daughter out of her nursery and noticed that the books that were normally on her side table were on the floor and also that her nightlight was off. I normally wouldn't think anything of that and I've seen that before but for some reason I decided to check our nanny cam footage. This is what I saw. Bam! See that? The books fell like off the table. That video chilled me and it also confirmed that everything I've been feeling in our house is not my imagination. Her daughter was telling her about this owl and she was like, please mommy, fix the owl, fix the owl. And you know, of course she's like, you know, okay, I'll fix the owl. And she's like, I don't know what she's talking about. Right. What's the owl? Come to find out when she goes in the middle of the night to the nursery, the owl is her nightlight. Oh. So whatever is torturing her in the middle of the night is turning her nightlight off. Oh, poor thing. Yeah, so she was really like wanting help. I mean, maybe you can reach out to her. This is her TikTok and offer her some help. Maybe say a prayer for her. This next clip, I cannot explain it at all. These people are at a funeral. There's this little kid by the, the funeral casket. I mean, obviously, you could see that this is a, a very serious matter, you know, so this is not clickbait, all right? What happens next is going to freak you out. Pay attention to the red circle right here. So you can see that there's a little kid there, and then there's there's something there in the corner. So keep watching, keep watching, because this is, this is insane. Kid sees it, he starts playing with this, what? and it gets sucked into the coffin. That's a coffin? It, it was a coffin, but what is that thread? Now I did a little bit of digging in the comments and somebody's like, you played this video backwards. You know, something was backwards about it. So I was like, okay, bet. I'm gonna play the video backwards and see mm -hmm. what I could find. Mm -hmm. The video does not look normal back. You could obviously see that the way it was played was perfect. It was not backwards, it was normal. But it's like, I mean, even the, the movement of the guy's hand, Literally looks like there's somebody in there trying to get out. What's truly terrifying though is like, what if there was somebody in this casket trying to get this person's attention? Oh man. Like what if they saw that video later on? They're like, we just buried a man that was alive, a man or a woman. I would be concerned that's exactly what could have happened. Like that is quite possible. This next clip, some place that you and I have been before. I could tell already. Okay, where, where can you guess? I would say that's Gettysburg. It is Gettysburg. It is when we went to Gettysburg, we ain't seen anything like this. If we did, I guarantee you we probably would have stopped ghost hunting. I, I don't even know what to make out of this. There's like a bunch of... Yeah, dude, there's like a bunch of these guys. It looks like they're fighting. It's like they're fighting a war. They, they look small, though. Like, they do. They look, almost look like little minions or something. But I don't know. I know people were shorter back in the day. Maybe that's what it is. Or maybe they're just hunched over. And then there's like a, a guy on top of this headstone. How, I, do you, how do you describe that? That literally... I don't know. That's not a person. And they're moving so damn fast. Like, it's terrifying to watch because it's just so much happening. Oh, it's a rabbit. You know, it jumps up, it hops. You know, it's a rabbit. <laughs> okay, it's not a rabbit. I don't know. I have no, maybe you guys can tell us in the comments because I have no idea. To my possession. So I saved the absolute best for last. The reason why, in my opinion, this is probably the best clip of this video, it's probably the most unexplainable. Let me know if you've seen anything like this. So a dude is opening up the fridge at the gas station and it looks oh, like hand stuck. It looks like he's getting electrocuted or maybe he had a seizure. 
Oh no, that's what I thought at first. Did you see that guy? He was like, he saw him. He, he ran just, off. He ran off. He didn't want anything to do with it. Like, look, he's ha he's having some sort of medical episode. I think you're right. I, I don't think this is paranormal. I think this is just somebody's having a medical episode. Watch closer, oh, though. Oh, no. Like, this is not a seizure. I mean, if you watch a little bit closer, it's almost like this like guy... Like possessed him or something. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, it gets better. Keep watching. Look, and the guy's... This... Oh, hell no. He pointed at him. I'm like out, too. <laughs> yeah. What? I mean, there's no foaming out the mouth. Like, what's going on with this guy? I mean, he's pulling his hair. He's looking up. And, I mean, he's going to turn into Hulk in a second. That's crazy. And then he just falls back. And then, look. If you look... Oh, whoa! I forgot all about that. I did not see that coming. So before that toilet paper fell onto the ground, you can see something almost like a mist or something of, a, of like a reflection. Right after that happens, of course, something falls. Like what made that fall? That's terrifying. Honestly, I thought it was just somebody having a medical episode. But when that happened, I mean, the guy that ran didn't knock that down. You can clearly see the shelf never moves, but the toilet paper falls. Like, how does that happen? I wonder if this guy died. Like, that's my concern, because when he fell to the ground, he you see hard. a mist of some sort on the left, and then it just, that or maybe whatever demon possessed him, got in and was like, okay, I'm good, I don't want to be here anymore. I'm not visiting that gas station, so no, I'll tell No, definitely not. Also, if you have any videos that you want to share with me or James, maybe you have something unexplainable yourself, hit us up. I'll have an email down below. Doesn't have to be paranormal. Maybe it could be mysterious. Maybe you caught an alien on video. That's what I was thinking. Those things in Gettysburg were possibly aliens. Maybe they like, were aliens. They were kind of little. Make sure to check out my bro, James. Link will be down below in the description. Gotta go for now before we leave. Give a kiss. Peace. I ain't sleeping at night. Neither am I. It's all right. That's all. Yeah. See you next time. Subscribe my channel. Bye.